I Am Angus is brought to you by the Igenity Profile for Angus, the industry's most comprehensive DNA profile. Thomas Angus Ranch was started my, by my dad, and um, they, my mom and dad were born in Iowa. I wanted to get into the, the uh, purebred um, Angus business, and so they um, were able to get a job in New York, um, working for C.V. Whitney as well as Myron First. Um, worked out there for a number of years, and were finally, finally able um, to move out west. Um, ended up here in, in, in Baker City and uh, built up a cattle herd um, just, just through the years and, and um, uh, over the last uh, 50 years we're able to kind of establish this ranch here in Baker City. Well, you know, when, when Lori and I first came back to the ranch and kind of entered into a partnership uh, with my parents, and it was, uh, you know, it was understood that, you know, we never, we never stand still and we just, we, we keep moving forward. So, you know, with their help, um, you know, we we're able to, to keep expanding and, 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 and grow where we are today. Um, um, right now we'll run about 1,200 cows, um, between 12 and 1,300 cows, and all, all registered. Um, we're 100% AI. We do a lot of embryo transplant. We'll, um, we'll put in a number of embryos into cooperative herds every year. And, um, and we hold two sales a year, one in October and, and one in March. And so, you know, we're, we, we just try to, um, uh, you know, continue to grow, continue to service our customers, and, and uh, continue to try to be on the forefront of, of all the technology we, we have available to us today. One of the things we do that's sort of unique in our operation is that we sell 10-month-old bull calves. Obviously there's some challenges to that, especially as uh, the ultrasound, ultrasound came into play. Uh, there was some data that we weren't able to provide uh, on a 10-month-old bull. So this, uh, the Igenity profile for Angus presented a really great opportunity for us to ascend, do that DNA work and get those markers and get some predictability for those bull calves. So our customers felt really comfortable in purchasing those calves um, at 10 months of age. Our customer base are, um, I guess I'd, you know, if, if I was going to put a term on them, it'd be professional um, because they're just strictly professional cattlemen. Um, they're full-time cattlemen. Uh, they, they, that's all they do for a living. Most of them are uh, larger operators. Um, uh, I'd say, you know, the majority of them would run over 500 cows and, and, uh, and a lot of them have 2,000 on up to, you know, eight, nine, ten thousand 10,000 cows. And so well, the identity profile for Angus, um, offers us a, a, a sense of risk management and it, 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 it gives our customers a, a sense of security knowing that there's more data than, um, than, than, than what we were able to offer before. And, and you know, we're able um, to use it you know, on, on, on our older bulls um, that already have maybe some yearling and, and, uh, and uh, ultrasound data. And we're able to, to add to it, you know, and maybe give those bulls you know, the, um, the, the accuracy of, of what, what a bull would have if, if he had, um, you know, say eight to 15 progeny, depending on what trait we're looking at. Um, you know, our plans are to use it on a number of donors um, to be able to select cows, you know, out of, out of our program that we feel will uh, not only give us uh, more predictability but higher accuracy and, and, uh, and be able to go after those cows that, that truly um, justify being in a Thomas Angus Ranch um, embryo transplant program. We take our relationship with our customers very seriously and uh, anytime we can add another element of technology like the Igenity profile for Angus, I think that that all adds all kinds of value and takes the guesswork out of uh, the equation for your customer. I think, you know, I think the Igenity profile for Angus, um, you know, it, it, it adds significantly to the cow herd as our customers continued to educate themselves and to have us educate them as far as just the value of the data that, that, that we're giving them. Um, you know, there's uh, these, these cowboys, I mean, they take enough risk as it is every day. And, um, and there's tre tremendous risk um, in this business. The last thing they need is, uh, is a bull that's not gonna go out there and, and, and do, do what they want him to do. And so uh, for us to be able to get, get more information on our cows, uh, to get more reliability on our cows and also more reliability on, on the bulls that, that we sell 
you know, out to the country, um, that's extremely valuable for us.